Shanghai, China. It is from here that Porsche's largest single market is managed. Porsche has been here for many years, and its fan base is growing all the time. Communication and innovation. Chinese customers are very keen to use the most advanced features as early and as often as possible. China is the largest market for electric cars and also has the largest growth rate, larger than we see in the US or Europe. For this market segment, Porsche has its fleet of innovative hybrids from the Panamera and Cayenne series, and purebred sports cars such as the 718 and 911 models are becoming increasingly popular here too. Our Porsche customers are not just younger, the gender balance is slightly different too. 50% of our customers are female, 50% are male. Chinese customers and consumers are accustomed to being mobile all the time and communicating, placing orders and retrieving information in lots of different ways. As a rule, Chinese customers don't sit down in front of a PC, open a browser and then look things up on the internet. They do everything on their mobile phones. The functionality available on a phone in the form of apps is fully integrated. They can do everything. They can communicate, place orders, they can access films for you and launch other programs. So you are working in an ecosystem in which you can organize all kinds of things, your daily life. And that's what we need to deliver. That's the path we have to pursue, because of course the expectation is that all these possibilities will be available. Porsche satisfies the demands of Chinese customers for digital services, whereby service-related concepts are a priority. In large cities in China, parking spaces are a rare commodity. We give our customers the opportunity to make their everyday lives and the use of their vehicle as pleasant and as efficient as possible. A big advantage in this connection is the possibility of searching for a parking spot, reserving a space and carrying out the entire underlying financial transaction. In order to uh, bring this uh, service to our customer in a more quicker way, we decided to use an application solution. The current technology basically is based on the Bluetooth technique. We put a lot of Bluetooth speakers. They could recognize the smartphone once it entered into the garage. And at the entrance of the garage, we put also a camera, which will recognize the car when it enters. Then it will do a match. Then the ground lock will know that the car, which has already booked the spots, has entered into the garage. Then the ground lock will get done automatically. Then the customer could just uh, park, it, park there directly. It's about the technology part. Connected communications is one issue. The joy of driving an outstanding sports car is the other. Here on the Formula One racetrack of Shanghai, visitors can experience the fascination of the Porsche firsthand. Our Porsche Experience Center, which is incidentally the first and only one of its kind in Asia, went into operation this year, so as to allow our product to be experienced in its natural habitat, as we like to put it. Here too, the dual offer is enthusiastically welcomed, on the driving simulator and then on the test track itself, with all the current models. Driving instructors show you what could be possible, this is followed by tentative first attempts. 12% growth starting from over 80,000 units. In 2018 too, China is Porsche's largest single market. Customers here are finding out more and more what makes Porsche so distinctive.